With apps, you can do a lot of things in medicine, from blood pleasure measurement up to exchange with physicians. Constantly, new applications become available. The latest are being presented here live at Medica App Competition. Mr. Wächter, you host the Medica App Competition this year. What do you think is very important for the jury? As Medica is a very professional platform, we're looking for B2B and B2B2C apps. So uh, to summarize, we're not looking into dietary or wellness or fitness apps, but into apps for doctors and hospitals and patients. Overall, 15 participants present the app for three minutes. How did the pre-selection happen? Well, from May to September onwards, there was an online platform live on F Success, and anybody who had a cool idea on a medical mobile solution could access and log in there and uh, submit for the app competition. And in total, it was like over 50 um, apps competing globally from all over the world, and 15 were then be in, uh, deliberated by a jury in October. And what prizes wait for the three top winners? Well, of course, first of all, recognition. Yeah? We are here at Medica, so we have lots of people going around here from the hospital and doctor's perspective. Secondly, every uh, top three place gets some money. Uh, but uh, thirdly, in, in my view, very important is that they also get uh, co-working space, free co-working space at Philips, for example. They get uh, mentoring from Startup Boost Camp, and they also got tickets to South by Southwest, the tech platform in Austin, Texas. You won the third prize. Can you shortly explain what your app can do? Uh, we have a device and a platform to perform remote physical examination at home. Instead of going to the clinic to be checked by a physician with a heart and lung sound, with a stethoscope and with otoscope for the ear and the throat, you can do it at home by yourself, send it over the web to the physician for making diagnostics, then you get the prescription and everything is ending up when you are in the comfort of your home. And how long does the development take? Uh, we established the company four years ago. We did our uh, first product and then uh, the second product, which is now going to be marketed in the US following the FDA clearance. And when can I buy it in store? In the US, you will be able to buy it uh, in, in a few months. Uh, in Europe, we are still uh, looking at uh, the potential of Europe. You have won the second prize. Can you show you explain what your app can do? Yes, sure. So actually we provide a physician a live map, colored map, with the suspicious areas. The probe identifies the suspicious areas and guided biopsies, so it, they have everything on the screen. It uh, actually uh, scan the tissue in 360 degrees in three minutes. It provides the physician a colored map so the patient can have the result immediately after the scan. It's effective, efficient and affordable. And how long does the development take? Well, we are now, uh, the company established in 2013. We are almost four years and we are now uh, filing through the FDA and CE uh, and do clinical trials in Europe and United States. We hope by the 2017 we have the product. And when I can buy it in store? hopefully by the end of 2017. You have won the first prize. Can you shortly explain what your app can do? Yeah, so we have an app that connects to a device, a smart device that you put on your body, and then it tracks your posture, and every time you start slouching, it vibrates, letting you know to be upright. So it teaches you to be upright. And how long does the development take? So we developed it for over two years. That's uh, how long we've developed it. And when I can buy it in store? You can already buy it on our site and on Amazon and other places, other e-commerce e stores. And right now we're doing the, the push into retail. So upcoming months, it's going to be exciting. Thank you very much. Thank you.